In the name of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Ghost, Amen. Jesus, Mary, St. Joseph, and St. Teresa, pray for us. And St. John of Parma, pray for us. So just an addendum to that last video I made. Yeah, it's sad that spouses want to hoard money and not share with their other spouse. But even more tragic than that, I think, is they don't give the money at least to the poor, to the holy souls. That's what strikes me the most, is that money for those books, those Appalachian books that are never ever going to be used, are going to, uh, they, that, that money could have been to have masses said for the holy souls. And that is so important right now. We have so many holy souls in purgatory that need help. St. Valentina Sidney Sear has said that. I know my mom and dad have wasted so much money in lawsuits against each other and other people, other relatives. And, and just a waste of time, my mom running to Oregon and working for Serena, sold her, sold us Steve and Serena software. Sterilized Steve and Serena software is what I like to say. But, uh, you know, she could have, you know, she could have used a bit of John's money to just have masses said for the holy souls instead of doing this crazy runoff. And it's sick, you know, the energy people expend on being bad. And... The amount of energy and pain and hatred that they persevere in being bad. All to go to hell forever? Really? Is it really worth it? Betsy, when all you could have done is just sit at home crocheting, teaching your children, driving to St. Nicholas Catholic Church on Sunday, and praising the Lord? Really? You really had to go off and do this bad stuff just so you could one-up John and get all jealous over how anything he likes including your daughter and and make this whole writ tear family tear apart the rest of your life and and corrupt Carrie and have her pin uh have her corrupt Asher I mean really or, or to keep him away from me for the rest of my life is that what you really want is that really making you happy because it seems to be totally dealing devil ears out of your head times 20 and it can't be really good for your body or your soul when they end up in hell forever uh it would have been better to just crochet at home and give masses to the holy souls and that's the same with my spouse too instead of all these stupid purchases coming the front door and i don't drive so you know i mean i see them come to the door and, and they're just worthless all that money could have get, been given to the poor could have been given to the holy souls it could have been given to some righteous things that could be done either to make rosaries or other things so let's just keep that in mind when we see this ridiculous spending going on in our own families and know god is in control but these people will eventually be weeded out and they won't enter the kingdom of god if they don't repent and they don't realize that every cent you spend will be accounted for just like every word you say every single penny you spend will be accounted for and what people what you think men don't see you better believe god sees it